hi guys welcome back to my channel um i wanted to do a fun actually like i wanted to do a just like corporate work week in my life but also like a check-in and on your daily goals like we set up those goals we like made that happen great but i want to check in and this is a great way to keep myself accountable so I just went to the gym, uh, well actually like two hours ago. I did an F45 workout. I can show you what I'm wearing. I'm wearing the, I'm a little bit bloated, but let's not talk about I'm wearing the Aritzia, um, I forgot the name of the pants, but the leggings. And then I'm wearing an Aritzia top, obviously, and just a sweater. And then, okay, so uh, pretty much, so I got a new tripod, which is kind of interesting. But anyways, so, Part of working on your goals, which is so great, is literally keeping yourself accountable. And I love breaking my goals into like smaller chunks. And honestly, it's so much better. So I wanted to do like a check-in and to see like what's working, what isn't. I know my goal for this month is to cook more. So honestly, a habit that's not tracked is not gonna get done for me. Um, I know there's a quote, it's like, a plan without a, like what is it, like a goal without a plan is just a dream or something, so I love tracking everything, it's like my favorite thing to do, just to keep myself accountable, so we are cooking, that's a long winded way to say that we are cooking, um, I made ground beef on Sunday, which is good, and I'm trying to get creative because I don't want to do the same recipes, but I also want to be quick, so I want to marry the quickness and a fun recipe together to make something fun. And um, today I was working from home, so that's that. And honestly, let's not blab too much. I just wanna show you what's around. But this is a new video of me just working on my goals and seeing what's up. So I'm gonna make, I have this ground beef defrosting and I'm gonna cut up an onion, I'll figure it out. And then I have a bunch of these sweet potatoes that I have. So that's that. Okay, anyways, and then I don't work on Friday, so I wanna set myself up for success, but you know what I've noticed? <gasps> I have so many things to tell you guys. I feel like I haven't vlogged in so long. Okay, I wanna say that, I don't know why with this new year, I feel way less overwhelmed. Like I've decided I'm posting once a week on TikTok, whenever the hell I have time on, um, on Instagram. Like, I want to post like once a weekly for sure. And then just YouTube, just like film as much as I can. And on TikTok, just do like s super short form content video. And I don't really feel that overwhelmed. I don't know why I felt so overwhelmed before. I can't pinpoint it yet, but I'm sure it'll come to me and I will tell you because I would get so overwhelmed. Like Instagram, TikTok, YouTube. Now I'm just like, frick it. Like, I'm just doing one TikTok a day for sure. And then whatever else I can do, like keeping up with the YouTube videos, and that is it. So let's get going. Also, I'm setting a timer because it's 9.15 and I want to be done very quick. So 18 minute timer, setting it and getting going because ain't nobody got time for that. Because I have a hard stop to sleep at 11, so I gotta freaking sleep on time, so. And I have to do a bunch of like other work, so. Great. Hey y'all, I added the beef as well, and I'm gonna chop up. We have so many freaking veggies that I need to chop up because otherwise they're gonna go bad. So I'm just chopping up whatever the heck I can find. We have Brussels sprouts, we have like so many veggies because I've been going grocery shopping and I have no idea what to buy, so I've been buying like everything. And yeah, so <laughs> we're probably skipping this week because I've spent so much money in our in my like recap video of like finance reset I'll tell you guys but I think I spent like 220 once I think 200 and I think 160 so I think we can skip this week because usually aiming for 150 and I'm already way over so yeah look at this y'all I'm almost done so I added the beef I added the peppers onions Tomatoes, please. We have so many extra tomatoes. I added a bunch, and I added this marinara sauce from Costco, of course. 
And yeah, and then I'm gonna add, I'm gonna boil some pasta and add that into here as well. And whatever else I can find, honestly. Because okay, so another one of like, I don't know about you guys, but I'm a really visual person. And I don't, sometimes I would really struggle. Like if I can't see something, I'd be like, it's so hard for me to like visualize it or like, think that I'm able to do it or I don't know just like if you okay you know what it just feels like a distant distant far away thing that never will get done so I did this yesterday it took me like an hour I mean two hours because by the time I figured it out but I you know how they say do it vision board like another one of like those tips and tricks that work really well is like whatever they say there's a reason why they say it works right but make it workable for you like everything you do make it workable for your own sake so like i know that personally like like creating a vision board i've done that last year um actually so first year that i did it i did it on a wall that was cute and all i never really looked at the wall and it wasn't very precise so that was in third year i think in university then i did another vision board where i did it on my wall like wallpaper on my computer i can show you guys it's good but it's so cluttered that like it stresses me out and raises my like cortisol levels and like it does not work but it takes trial and learn to figure it out and now this year i created and it's not like i i just like every year i thought of creating this like it's just through trial and error i figured out hey like this doesn't fully work but you don't fully know how to fix it so you don't do much about it but okay so the third way is wait why is it not showing okay there you go so i created i created a vision board so as a heads up i got a new phone but anyways not the point i got it i made a vision board on my phone i just got the iphone 14 i'll do like um an unboxing not an unboxing but like what's in my phone tag video but i made it on canva i just did it like a uh, iphone wallpaper size and then i just put um all the things that I, you have on your like yearly list you put them like what does that represent to you so it could be a pretty fun activity you go on pinterest and then you find pic nice pictures that really inspire you because i'm really visual and it's really hard for me to get inspired with just like words or like repetition like i don't know it just doesn't always work so creating a vision board of like what i want my dream life to look like is like my favorite like i have all aspects like i'll put like I put like my favorite motivational quotes, I like, I'll put like my fitness inspo, like not that I'm not at a, like a weight that I want or like whatever, but just like, like, I don't know. It just inspires me to get up and get moving. Like that's what it is for fitness. And then um, for like, what else? Then there's my wedding. So like I put a picture of like a nice dress that I liked. And then what else did I do? I put, like this is my favorite hair it's just like my favorite like if it's like long beachy waves like that's what I would dream of like my dream hair to look like and then just like pretty sunsets pictures with envy my fiance oh whoops uh, pictures with envy my fiance 2023 productivity getting things done like really like taking away my ego and just like going at it and being accountable that I'm the only one if I want to get something done I'm the only one that can get it done uh, what else do I have I want to get like um 10k tiktok followers and get thousand subscribers what else do I have I have like sunset pictures I have like a really cute this is enough this is a really cute picture of like a cute couple and that inspires me because I feel like Envy and I are a cute couple but just like reminds us of like Taking in the small moments because I feel like we're so busy and like sometimes we're just in this like always like hustle like what more can I do and we don't get time to enjoy ourselves so it's just like 
taking a moment and enjoying time with each other and a nice beach because why not and then that I'm creating the life of my dreams and it's if not then when that's my goal and my like my best like motivator every time I do stuff is consistency um, like for me I always feel like I gotta remind myself that consistency is more important than anything else and more important than putting in extreme efforts at times so consistency is more important than perfection feel the fear feel the fear and do it anyway and the thing that like really gets me going like out of bed every day is like those little things add up and that those little things really make a big difference so do all the little things you have no idea how big of a difference it's gonna make is that exponential growth like that's what motivates me the most and that's it in the picture of that so like i don't know like that really made my phone super better i mean aside from getting a new phone that's a completely different story that's just because i my other phone got stolen but this is my new wallpaper and i love it so do something that motivates you and then that you open your phone like it's weird because like you you think that then because I, I got a new phone like i'd be more motivated to stay on my phone but actually since i have that wallpaper i don't know i feel like I want to go after the life of my dreams and I want to do all the things that I want to do for me so I actually don't want to stay on my phone more because I'm more motivated and I see that dream life that uh, I've created so like that I want to create you know that I'm manifesting anyways that's enough talking uh, what else was I going to show you guys I feel like I want to show you something else oh these are the inspos that I wanted to show you guys so these are the inspos I found on Pinterest, like these are not mine, but like I started off initially like googling a wallpaper from Pinterest and I didn't know which one to use and then I was like, you know what, and then I found a couple and they're like so good, like they're so well made, like family with cars and like whatever, like beaches and like super pretty pictures, this one was nice, like I just screenshotted the ones I really liked, like dreaming of traveling and like I don't know, like mindset is everything. I'm like, oh, like just the process, creating your life of your like the one you like. This one is more like aesthetically pleasing with like really beautiful quotes like trust your work, be the reason someone believes in the goodness. It's time to choose yourself. Uh, be addicted to bettering yourself. I really like that one. Um, do you for you? This one was beautiful as well. Just like being healthy, being the best version of yourself, learning, growing. Just doing, like, I really like this one too. And this one really inspires me. And then there's this one. I think this is like more of a school one. But it's honestly beautiful. Like, I didn't try to create, take that many. Just to use the ones I had. Like, the ones that I really liked off Pinterest. And I think that is it. This one's beautiful, like show up for your highest self. Like, so, oh, this one, the universe has your back. Like um, everything like supports you. Like I'm becoming a best version of myself. Um, breathe, this is your dream are coming true. Like this one's beautiful too. I really like this one. But some of the things, oh, this one too. Like they're all so beautiful and I felt so inspired. Make yourself proud, like this one's really nice. So those are all the suggestions. This one's so nice too. They're all freaking gorgeous. Anyways, progress is better than perfection. Anyways, and I was like, I don't know which one. Like, and I pull one up and I'm like, this doesn't feel me. Like, it feels me. If don't don't get me wrong, it feels like me. But like, I don't know how to explain it. I'm like, I want exactly what like resonates with me. So I was like, I'm gonna create my own. I mean, I did spend like a solid hour and a half doing it sometimes. It seems like it's super easy, which it is pretty easy, but like fine. once you get into it and you find the right pictures, it's honestly great. And then you get, it's like your own vision, you know? Because it's tailored to you, so I love it. That's another way that you can work on your goals. And then again, like always have daily reminders, like another thing. I'm setting alarms for everything now, like... <laughs> To be on time, I'm setting an alarm to leave. To go to bed, I'm setting an alarm to leave. So y'all, that is, these are all great habits and always have your daily reminders of like your water next to you. So that is how I plan on work, working on my goals. Uh, I think I'll close up this video here and we're gonna start a new one because I think these are great tips and tricks. Like if I knew this earlier, 
I would do this more often, but like having all of those reminders, like your workout clothes ready. I have my workout clothes ready for tomorrow. Here I can show you guys. Like I have all my workout clothes, like all my leggings, like literally three pairs, four pairs of leggings, all my shirts, and then my shoes that I need to find room here to put in everything ready to go because I don't want to take forever tomorrow. So those are our tips and tricks. So yeah, thanks so much for watching and I'll see you guys in my next video.